Hi, this is Vinod from VS Infotech. Um, today I discuss the topic is everybody expecting for Tally Prime update release. Um, already I much more video uploaded regarding uh, GSTR2 reconciliation tool. Yes, now ready GSTR2 reconciliation tool to support with Tally Prime. This tool, everybody know that to reconcile your purchase, purchase as per book and purchase as per your portal. What are the ITC you are availed from portal? That database you can match with as per your tally purchase books. Now see, I will show you what is the update is there in tally prime. GSTR2 reports as usual same sales register as per <coughs> sales any problem is there you can view any error is there you can view easily same concept already i already explained so see so igst payable receipt wrong tax calculation some transactions if you are getting any problem wrong tax calculation calculation and uh, uh, supply type of supply it's not available in your transactions so what are the particular transaction what are the error is there you can easily identify this one already much more time i have explained so i am go for another one this is gstr1 so gstr1 if, for example if you are uploading the uh, sales transaction in your database but uh, in your portal but some parties it is not available the itc uh, suddenly you are getting the call Sir, I am not a expect. I am not a received the ITC. So you can download your JSON file from GST portal. After that, you can call that JSON file in this path. You can view what are the transaction. It is not affected some particular customer. So this is the GSTR one reconciliation tool. I am not much more explaining GSTR one because of. Uh, um, GSTR1 already I told many more time and important things is GSTR2A reconciliations. So now you can see GSTR2A reconciliation tool with ITC capping rule. Uh, already my file is there CTDL 2021. I downloaded all the files. This financial year all the files JSON files downloaded from portal. So now I connect that. See. Yes. Yes, this much of transaction is there already much more I explained so match transaction everybody know that so that's why I don't care about that match red transactions. So we are go for only C unmatched transactions. See now perennial systems total transaction as per my book 13 transaction is there as per my portal 12 transactions one transactions perennial systems it's not uploaded. So I drill down the particular options. So see, partially found, partially found means uh, uh, 15, 6, 15, 6, 1 transactions. As well as this report, you can see one good options, returns filed date. If I make the bill, purchase bill, but especially that particular party, that particular party, which date returns filed that column will appear new updates and document type purchase or debit note whatever it is you can see the document type so that details and returns filed that guy was to returns filed or returns it's not filed so that information will appear here okay And then next one, verify GST number. So everybody know that already. Um, next thing, so really need for everyone perennial systems for the month of only April two is there. Uh, now I get I set the set status. See set two year status. What are the positions? So now I called 
control a r space bar space bar space bar that means all the transaction now i am selecting and next i will give the set status yes if i am updating my status see right now new option 1 if match transaction means it is same is that like your as per book and as per portal same is that so that's why that transaction was matched so it is called as right now we are approved what is the meaning of approved try to understand customers once this transactions approved that means if you are give the set status to your status automatically the transaction will be approved So now if I put the enter, the transactions, it is not possible to modify. Why? Because of that transactions is matched. So that's why once modified, once modified, you are getting the problem as an accountant or chartered accountant to file the returns. So after that, anyone that means data entry operator to modify the transaction, what will happen? The tax is mismatching as per portal and as per books so that's why once approved that transactions you are not modified so if you want modify if you need for modify just go for alter gstr status once alter gstr status after that you can possible to modify these transactions so this is the way that means one of the lock system available this updated release so now i am seeing my report display accounts book ledger and perennial systems see you will get it the approved and not in portal that information so now i am select the period alt to full financial year if I go for bill wise details, if I go for bill wise details, if you are give alt P, preview, preview it's not showing. Okay, so previously in tally ERP and release, what will happen? You will get it that two page of printout. In your outstanding GSTR 2 year status is there. If you think to take the printout and send the copy to your uh, supplier. So at the time of you will get it that two pages. So right now it will be shrinked. It will come on only single page. So that problem already there in ERP 9 that has been resolved right now. As usual GSTR 2 year status. same things and previously uh, what will happen some little bit little bit uh, not a much more bigger problem some little bit problem is there in this tool that problems or everything right now resolved as well as new update will come enable auto email auto email means so if you are Pass the information that means if you are registered the your mail ID so what will happen the customer to get the information for example partially found is there that means you are make the transaction 10 transaction but you are getting the report from portal only seven transaction is there remaining three transaction it is not available so automatically what will happen once partially found transaction is there the transaction automatically sent to the party so how to send you think how to send so you can put mail id that particular party mail id in that particular ledger so so some much more updates is there and as well as previous tally erp9 bugs also resolved 
so really useful for all the chartered accountant and accountant and b2b business person everyone thanks for watching